Hello there, friends of music. This is Martin from the Vote of Art YouTube channel. Every time I see new Japanese bands showing up and getting the attention, it's great for me. Because back then, when I discovered Bandmate, Love Bites, Access Trace, other bands from different uh, eras, it really it was so amazing. And then seeing the next generation of musicians coming and doing their thing is the best. And Neki is one of these inspiring new bands. Uh, they have released for two months Get Over, which I've worked at last week. It was fantastic. It has this bandmate attitude as they're inspired by them, but still also other influences. Liberty Gacha Spin with the bass playing. Uh, but for me, already they had their own vibe and steel. The punkish, the vocalist had her own unique sound. And now the new song is out, which is translated to Young Woman Who Displays the Feminine Virtues of Old Japan. Or Young Woman Who Shows Little Promise. I don't know if this is any correct. Uh, so when you know what the title means, please feel free to write it in the comment box. I would say with not further ado, we go straight into this. This guitar tone, fantastic. Starting with this hard rock guitar sound and then bass lapping, and then you're going to the the song itself. This really gave me this 2000s vibe, you know, with also the how she sings it, 
how the melodizes has such this nostalgic feel. It's a song you have headphones on and you listen to and just, you know, you're enjoying this. It's so, it's, it's, it's really fantastic. Really this 2000s uh, walk, J-walk feel. I love it. As I said last time, you, you, of course, you feel the influences in their playing style. Yeah. That we can say the band made an attitude, but still uh, they have their own fear already. Uh, for my ears. I don't like to just be, okay, they are, ah, this sounds like Batman. Oh, this sounds like Batman. Because, no, they're their own band. They're doing their own craft. They may be inspired by they're doing their own music, writing their own music, I believe. Um, they've also played it live. I saw things on TikTok and so where they played in, you know, it's like the typical style of a band. They're playing in little clubs and little places. Uh, but their sound, Last time, Get Over had this punk attitude, also great catchiness. Here we have more a layback, really groovy, and these two songs always gave it a nostalgic feel, but also it sounds refreshing, you know, because the sound and everything, really the production quality is, of course, fantastic. The drumming, everything. It's like really all instruments play in harmony, and nothing is like, okay, this put you out of this, this wide. You know, with like, oh, now the bass is too loud or the guitar is too different. Everything fits perfectly. Also, her voice, her voice tone is more higher. Up, it fits for this rock, punkish flair they're going through. For me, she has a certain sound. Also, in her, her in general, in her voice that makes her recognizable. Ah, you know, I uh, say, okay, this is this is Neki. This is the voice. It has its own character, which I really enjoyed. Last time also, I was like, oh, this was nice. She has a great sound. Also, when she goes in the falsetto, beautiful done. Also, the scenery, them standing there. It's fitting all. It's, it's, it's not over, you know? It's like, it's not over done. Okay, we do now a crazy solo. It's like harmony. And then you can follow everything. So it's really beautiful. It's really like solid. It's solid already. And yeah, I'm really into uh, how this uh, other songs from this EP will be and how they grow. You definitely have this hard rock feel, they're, they're punkish, they really can go heavy. You hear it also on the guitar tone. This is really this grunge where, yeah, a certain way they, they, you hear this heaviness, but also this soft side, this rock, J rock feel. It definitely, the future is bright. All of them are solid and already professionals. You know, it's like you see their sound is solid. I mean, Canada on the bass, she freaking goes slapping wild. She's already an excellent player. And also Chuko on the drums, uh, the guitar, Natsu does, and Hika. You know, it's playing rhythm, playing guitar and singing at the same time is not easy. You know, as I, said, I don't know how young they are, probably in their 20s. Yeah, they're the next one that will rise and I'm here for it. So it's really like a new generation, not something, okay, a super group formed, this is like a new, totally new band, and I'm here for it. Yeah, Neki, first EP, exclamation, will be out on July 24. Now we have two singles out, we have two different sides from them, a more energetic and more a layback and, and emotional one. Both of them are really great. CD, it will have five songs. Blink is also one that played live already, so... I don't know if we also get a music video for this one. And uh, yeah, everything else as usually in their video description. There have also the lyrics there. So what are your thoughts on this? I will love it and can't wait for more. So until next time, goodbye.